see in the last class we had a discussion about enterprise structure and types of purchase organization okay so uh, in today's session we'll see um, the functionalities of uh, sap ecc gui that is graphical user interface okay one icon here sap logon okay so you need to enter into this then you need to give uh, the server details so server details i have uh, already shared with you you just uh, enter as i have explained in the video okay so before entering into this uh, sap gui so let me explain so in today's session we are going to create this enterprise structure okay so this enterprise structure we are going to create in sap so this is the basic thing we are we need to create in any implementation project okay so this is very 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 important without this you, you can't able to move ahead okay so so next see next we'll see how to create this enterprise structure see first we need to create company company code plan storage locations purchase organization and purchasing group purchase group okay so to create see one thing i will tell you so whatever the process i am explaining you know you just note down okay procedure so keep in mind this is very important so from today onwards i will give assignments on daily basis okay so what you need to do is you need to uh, see whatever the sessions i will do na so particular sessions whatever you will practice that you need to prepare task okay that will be task for you so you need to maintain the report and you need to send it to me okay suppose to create uh, what is the procedure for enterprise structure you need to write down the procedure and you need to send it to me so in the company also they will do the same thing whatever the process they will do they will note down they will maintain in their own document okay kindly follow that so just like a script so i have told you uh, so just uh, type the t codes okay so t codes to check the material to check the vendor and all you have specific t codes okay accordingly you need to maintain so in this session i am explaining you see from now you have to maintain you and you need to write the script okay so fine so let me start the enterprise structure here so we'll create first company okay see to create enterprise structure we need to go to spro so likewise you need to write the script in word word file okay so to create enterprise structure you just write the script like right? go to spro t code s p r o and just press enter okay then you need to go to s Re sap reference img okay just click on this okay so once you click on this here we have enterprise structure you need to click this arrow don't click this click this arrow so once you click that arrow here we have two things one is to define one is to one is assignment so define see we need to do both the things here define definition means so we have to define the company here see define the company company code plant storage location and purchase organization okay that we need to do next in assignment what we need to do we need to assign see assignment what we need to do we need to assign this company to company code company code to plant plant to storage location and plant to purchase organization that i will tell you how to do that okay so first 
go to definition see in definition you need to go to financial accounting to so go to financial accounting then here we have define company okay so click this right mark button don't click this uh, button so click this so once you click on that see you will get one page where you have to create a company name okay so i will try to create on company name that is this one this company okay so how to create so here position is there i will tell you what exactly the position is there what you need to do you need to click on this new i am going to create a new company click on new entry see here you need to give company name see company name will be of uh, more than four letters you can use okay so what i will uh, i will give uh, m i t t a l mittal okay then here i will give m i t t a l mittal groups okay next here street i will give any street i uh, will give as uh, anything you can give are mandra in or in bombay i am giving okay so whatever you want you can give it for practicing okay then i will give any post box number post code number in real time you need to give whatever you have the data okay so city you can give bombay see country this is very important so here see you will get one icon you just click on that you need to assign the company see as this is a practice server okay you need to give only this country germany because this is a german software whatever the tax codes whatever the gl accounts has been defined with respect to german okay that's why you need to give country as german where is the german See here, Germany. Okay, DE. Double click on this; it will assign. Again, language key. Click on this. You can give English here. So whatever I am giving, same thing you need to give. Don't change anything. See if you change this uh, Germany to India in uh, the coming sessions, you won't uh, get anything. Okay. Here you have to give English. Then currency you have to give as per the country. For Germany, we will give uh, euros. Where is the euro? Euro, euro. Uh, we have euro. Yeah. Okay. Double click on this. See. So we have maintained the data. We need to save it here. We need to save. See, you can use Control S also to save. See here. This is very important. See, while saving the company, it is asking. the prompt for customizing request see this is very very important okay see you, you have you, you have created a new company it is asking the request we need to create one see this request we are going to call it as a transfer request see here i will tell you so why the transfer request will come see we are working in development server we have created a company code okay whatever the company code we have created we need to generate a transfer request to the abappers okay abapp team okay so why we need to give so in the coming sessions you will come to know you just try to understand only this thing so what you have to you need to generate new transfer request right to create new transfer request here we have new button click on this create request so what i will do here i will give um mm, I'll give M I T T L Mittal Groups Company. Okay, and enter. See, new request has been generated, and give right now. See, we have created data was saved. Once you get it, don't forget to click on save button. 
okay see here then so so far we have created company see suppose if you want to search see already see here go back here we have defined company click on this if you want to check where we have the company you need to click on position see position is nothing but search click on this position company give m i t t a i sorry t t a l mithal see here we have so already we have created just go back see here we have three options so this will go back and this what happens the suppose uh, you have entered into any company okay suppose if you want to go entirely to the first page you just click on this it will come directly here in spro configuration so this we will call it as a spro configuration okay so we have defined the company see in fact see you just note down the path enterprise structure and in enterprise structure we have definition in definition we have financial accounting see in real time okay in the company this company and company code will be created by the fico consultant okay not by mn consultant uh, for the practicing things uh, i am explaining you and you need to know all these things okay so company we have created here there is that okay yeah company we have created all right next next we need to create company code what is the difference between company and company code what is company company is a group company code is subsidiary companies suppose we have tata groups of company under the tata groups of company we have tcs we have tata lxc and we have tata motors we have titan okay we have several uh, group, uh, companies are there see here we have edit copy delete check company code you need to click on this so after completing this you need to click on this so once you click on this see here you need to double click on this copy delete check company code double click on this so once you double click on see you are not getting anything because you are creating a new company see here we need to click copy see while creating company you had new entry right <laughs> that means you have created a new company but while create company code you need to copy the existing standard company okay for practicing the things okay see here you just click on this copy fine oh here see whenever you are practicing in future you will get this error data locked by user okay if you get this type of uh, error what you have to do you need to use one t code note down this if you get locked error you need to use this data which data i will use uh, in new screen slash wo the t code you note down t code is sm12 t code is sm12 to delete locked data for that slash wo sm12 because 